serve the needs of other people. Well, there's this one news station that's even giving KTC a run for its money. The CEO, a 10 year old student from Mir Elementary. Our Kendria LaFleur explains. From here? As 10 year old Ethan St. Julian and his family look through pictures, there's one that stands out that determined his future. At a young age, Ethan has had a love for journalism, and he took that passion to a whole new level. Four, three, two, Good morning, Katiana, Even St. Julian here with Even News. I watched uh, the news and just started wanting to do it. And then, I mean, one time it was just a little thing and I started doing it and I got more into it and then I built this. No, I don't get nervous that much. While most children have a playroom, Even has his own news studio decked out with a desk to anchor in. I'm sitting at where I do the news. This is uh, where I put, I, in the corner I put my, um, laptop there and then I read off of that but I look up a couple of times. A weather lab. There's speed and direction. And pretty much everything you need to run a new station for a kid. This is my notebook I keep my scripts in. Evan's former teacher helped kickstart his new station by teaching him how to shoot and edit his own videos. Since then, Evan posts his segments on Facebook and goes live from social media with the help from his family. Even has always been a little old soul. He wasn't playing with toys and doing all that stuff. He was either being a teacher, being a principal, and then all of a sudden now it's, Mom, I want to be a news anchor. Can I build a studio? And I'm like, well, baby, you know, do you, do you? But running your own news station can be tough for this 10-year-old. Even says it's also tough to get other people on board. It gets nerve-wracking because I'm like, well, I'm going to do the news this weekend. Help me get the scripts together, and then next thing you know, birthday party to go to. Sorry, can't do it. I'm like, oh. While it's a lot of hard work, even says he's preparing for the future. His dream is to be a news anchor and a reporter. It's it's amazing, you know. Um, it's emotional because as a mom, you want to see your boys, your kids, your girls, do what they love and do it to their fullest and makes me see that, hey, I'm doing my job right. Water back on because In Mir, Kendra LaFleur, and even St. Julian for KTC TV3. And okay. Evan's here at the big yeah, desk Yeah, we figured right why now. not bring him in, right? Welcome okay. to KTC. Thank you. First and foremost, you're way more organized than we are. Yeah, you saw those scripts and notebooks sure and that. everything's in its we place. We have piles of things at our desks. Yeah, don't look yeah. at our desks. And by the way, we just got a talking to from our boss. Because we did. Even is doing Facebook Lives and we, we and slack And he's that. using like filters and stuff that and Jim banners. and I are kind of like, we yeah, okay. About it. So <laughs> you're showing us up. Our yeah. boss is already tips? on us. Tips? He's been watching us over here. We need some advice. What do you think? Mm. Uh, Y'all do everything perfect. Oh, oh. hey, we hey, love him. Listen to that Never mind. over there in the corner <laughs> office. <laughs> okay, so what's coming up next is what we call a bump. Mm -hmm. It's where we tell people what's coming up after we have commercial breaks. So we'll let you, the professional here, yeah. take okay. care of it for take us. Take it away. <laughs> All right, let's still to come on Acadiana's news channel at 5. Facebook is hinting at some changes. We'll tell you what it means for your news feed at 521. That's after Eric's two year forecast for where you live. We'll be right back. There you go. Good job. Fantastic.